Hey, hey, it's week 18 of marathon training. Today, our first in-person race since like March of 2020. Yep. We're running a little behind. We had planned to get here at eight o'clock, get all signed in, run three miles, and then make it back to the start line in time for the 5K to finish out our six mile day. But it's looking like we're probably going to show up in the start line after the race has already started. But hey, fewer crowds, so. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> so stick around. We'll take you along on the race route. If you haven't subscribed, hit subscribe. If you like, hit like. Oh yeah, and it's also like 49 degrees. Yay. It's pretty cool. So our training plan for this uh, 18th week of training is six miles today, but the in-person race is a uh, 5K. So we're running three miles first. We're headed back now and hoping we get to the starting line just about the time it starts. If they start late, we should be ready. Yeah. Well, we're ending our three mile warm up. And we're coming in close to the starting line. You can see it off in the distance. We made it. The race hasn't started yet. Oh, and we get to hear where we're going.
that's quite the hill. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> you get some water? No. No, it's all dirty. Not until there's a cure for rigs. Thank you. We're in the home stretch. We have less than a mile to go, or maybe a mile Not to go. Much. We forget about that point one. Yeah. <laughs> Three point one. So far, it's been great. Oh, this is a tough hill, but at least we go down this time. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, happy Halloween. Well, we're coming up on the finish line. Yay. I got this in the distance. We just beat our best 10k time. Oh man, we ran and our fastest 10k. Thank you for supporting the Exceptional Georgetown Alliance. Today. Deciding to ride at 6.2. Helping program. It's 67 minutes. For special needs kiddos in here That's in Georgetown. It. For Week 18 in the book. We'll have a short and recap on the drive home. Program. We gotta go. Ooh, we gotta, Thanks for joining us. Doctor? Is that a doctor? Well, hello. So, uh, we were saying we haven't uh, done this kind of. A uh, video update in a while, not since, um, I don't know, the last time we were training. So we are on our way home from our local running park where we happen to run at 5k today, in addition to running three miles ahead of time. Um, and now we're hitting the road to go home to take the fastest shower ever so we can hit the road again and go to a wedding rehearsal that we will be barely squeaking by to make it on time. So that's our morning. Uh, the run though, went very well yeah it really did very well the weather is absolutely perfect it is well it's not giving me the temperature right now do you know what the temperature is right now temperature is uh, 46 degrees fahrenheit 46 it feels so good outside um so we got there uh we planned to get there by 8 we probably got there about 8 15. the race started at 9 that we figured that would give us just enough time to have like a leisurely little three miles around the park before we ran the actual 5k um, but what happened was it took a long time for us to get checked in. Um, they couldn't find us. They kept misspelling our names, whatever. And then like, they forgot to write down our, our bib numbers after they gave them to us. So they had to chase us down for that. Then they gave us like the wrong size t-shirts. They had to chase us down for that. So anyway, we didn't start running our pre three miles until about 8.30, 8.30, um, which if, I don't know, we don't really talk about this a lot, but it, it normally takes us probably 35 minutes to run three miles normally, something like that, like 11, 12 minute mile. Um, so we were like, okay, we're not gonna make it to the start of this race. Well, we ran our three miles and then we made it to the start of the race, like right on time. We, we had just enough time to kind of catch our breath and then the race started and then we ran a 5K and at the end of it all, 
I stopped my watch and we were right at 6.2, according to my watch, and we were at our fastest, it, to my recollection, the fastest 10K we'd ever run. So we, we ended at uh, 67 minutes, um, and I, I believe an hour and nine minutes was our best time prior. So win, win, win. It was also a super small race, and we think we may have actually had a chance of placing in our age groups, which again, <laughs> Not uh, not due to how fast we ran, yeah. but due to uh, how small the pool is. Um, but because we have to get to this uh, wedding rehearsal, we we just we waited around as long as we could. But they're just kind of like drawing a million raffle door prizes, and like, they're about to do a kids costume contest, yeah. and we just don't have time. So yeah. we got to go home and rinse off <laughs> and go yeah. make ourselves presentable. You know, it was a really well-coordinated, well-run uh, race. And again, our first in-person race since March of 2020. Almost two years. Thank you yeah. to all the volunteers. They yes. did a great job. It was lovely. It was lovely. So, uh, okay, well, we're officially back in the game. Um, again, it's been a really long time since yeah. we've run an in-person race, and I feel like this was a pretty good one to kind of dip our toes in. So um, we actually have another in-person race in, what, two weeks? Yeah. We're running a half marathon here in town, so that'll be fun. Um, and it'll finally be a different route. So this one, oh, great, we're running a race, but it's the same park we always run in, so it's, <laughs> you know, nothing new. Yeah. Um, let's see, what else? What else is happening? There are 68 days till we leave for the marathon. Yes. 68 days that is it's really really neat we're excited yeah this this race is really fun it's been a long time since we've run with anybody so it was a lot of fun uh, mm -hmm. so yeah we're we're psyched remember we are uh posting videos every week and this is week 18 10 more weeks of oh, training oh my goodness this, and this is going to, it's going to go so fast. Like the holidays always do. It's just going to be over before we know it. <sighs> Let us know how you're doing. Let us know if you're uh, racing. Keep in touch. We love hearing from you. Thanks for all the tips. Really, really coming in handy. Uh, I got to tell you, always an adventure <laughs> with you.